सो हाई डियर वर्गो यस विरोन वर्गो हाई डियर वर्गो अ वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू यू गाइज दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज अ जर्नल अ रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द वर्गो सन मून मीनस राइजिंग कीप इन माइंड दिस इज जनरल इट माइट और माइट नॉट रेजोनेट विद यूर द फर्स्ट प्लेस द सेकेंड थिंग द रोल्स कैन बी रिवर्स ऑल्सो थर्ड थिंग दिस इज अ रीडिंग फ्रॉम सेकेंड टिल द एट ऑफ अक्टूबर एंड दिस इज वैलिड फॉर एवरी ट्वेल्थ साइन दैट यू आर डीलिंग विद अलॉन्ग विद योर ओन साइन सो लेट स्टार्ट वर्गो योर पर्सन और योर पार्टनर्स करंट फीलिंग्स फॉर यू right now at this present moment we have king of cups somebody is falling in love for virgo yeah see the king of cups is here so there's lots of love or somebody feels like there's a lots of potential in the situation between you and them a very mature and grounded kind of energies around you right now at this present moment for some of it could be possible that someone sees you in a very mature and grounded grounded kind of energy like you are the type of person who is grounded mature stable emotionally and they feel a connection with you let's clarify the king of cups we have the knight of wands the three of cups and the queen of wands hmm this is someone who is feeling a lot of physical attraction towards you at the same time they feel like you are a very mature and grounded kind of person Wow, it could be an on and off kind of a person. It could be like a who is on and off, in and out of your life. They keep on coming back. Then, then they are ghosting you. Then might be not ghosting you. You guys are not talking like a continuous and flow of talking or conversations is not there. I think so. Someone feels like uh, coming towards you for like celebrating life with you, and they are very, very, very attracted to you. Oh my God, Virgo, what is what is happening? Someone is very attracted to you and your personality here, and it's kind of. like uh, you both are liking it the bo both of you are liking the energies of each other and the roles can be reversed also please keep in mind it could be you feeling lots of attraction lots of pull towards somebody and at the same time you are feeling like this person this situation is very mature and grounded kind of energy you might be wanting this kind of energy from a very long time and now it's here wow <laughs> amazing because when you have passion and love are together it's something amazing it creates a very beautiful kind of dynamic so right now this person is feeling a very strong pull towards you they feel like celebrating life with you and they feel like taking this situation handling this this situation with maturity or they feel like you are the one person who is very mature and grounded and that is why they are getting so much attracted to you wow and this is uh, this person feels like you are single and independent and uh, you have lots uh, lots of things that you can uh, share with them you have lots of energy good energies good vibes This is a very good feeling and energy. Let's see what do you feel about this particular person or situation? Five of Swords. Okay, you can't stop thinking about them and you are conflicted right now. You might be very conflicted right now. Your your like energies are kind of not that much open to this person as their energies are open to you. Your conscious mind is like stopping you from going forward here, I think. Let's clarify the five of swords. We have the seven of swords, the eight of cups, and the ten of swords. Oh my God! You are walking away from something or someone who like betrayed you in so, like who betrayed you so badly. You are not over that situation yet. Wow! You scared the shit out of me, Virgo. you are still thinking about the past relationship that didn't worked out or something something bad happened with you somebody got betrayed either you betrayed somebody or somebody betrayed you here and you are trying to move on from that situation you are still still not over something that uh, that uh, that was ugly that ended very badly it was sudden unexpected and it was a very deep kind of deep rooted kind of betrayal that you felt you are you are trying to move on and your conscious mind is telling you to stop and uh, think about it and then move forward wow my god you like this person you have emotions for this particular person or energy but because whatever like uh, you have gone through in your life you are not able to trust anyone here that is the issue here virgo oh god see i i got i like i got sweaty because of this <laughs> let's see what this person wants from you very heavy energy that you are carrying around within yourself first of all let's see what this person wants from you now it could be like a new person a new energy that's around you wow seven of wands 
okay i think right now this person is not also that much opening up to you or they think that you are the one person who is not opening up to them completely okay they want you to open up they want you to remove the blockages they want you to uh, like uh, let go of the guards that you are like creating like around you let go of the boundaries okay let's clarify the seven of wands so right now this is a situation if even if true people true connection true situations are coming somebody with the like genuine intentions are coming towards you you are kind of blocking their energies we have the ace of cups and the king my god this person wants to help you heal virgo this person wants to help you heal they want you to open up your heart chakra you open up your emotions they want you to give like they want to give love to you and they want to let like, help you to come out of this painful and stressful kind of energies depression kind of energies that you are carrying around oh my god somebody here is uh, like uh, somebody uh, around you is uh, here to help you to come out of your uh, trauma and but they want you to open up with them that is the, that is the challenge here you are not ready to open up to them and it's like mutual respect kind of energy where you respect this person and they are falling in love with you or they are falling in love with the idea of having you in their future but you are kind of closed off here now the rules can be reversed please take it how it resonates with you guys yes they want you to be very blunt and honest with them even if it is going to hurt them or you or anything but they want you to open up to them they are ready to heal you and help you to heal very beautiful and healing kind of energy or oh my god please take it how it resonates with you if it's not resonating it's not your story there is someone around you who is trying to help you heal uh, even if they are just a friend kind of energy but they have lots of love and care for you in their heart and soul uh, let's see what do you want from this particular person or situation virgo hi priestess you just want to listen to your intuition right now you just want to keep your things keep your emotions and keep your energies to yourself you are like i don't want to open up i don't want to be a part of any kind of uh, connection right now because i am not uh, ready yet let's clarify the high priestess even if you are physically ready like uh, on the conscious level you are like okay i'm ready let's go i think you are not ready your con your subconscious mind <laughs> sorry your heart and soul <laughs> oh my god i got a very good uh, what we call that somebody is missing me yeah okay so anyway back on track you just want right now to be with yourself within yourself the queen of pentacles the king of pentacles is of source you just want to go ahead uh in this connection or in your life in general in your love life in general when you are going to be 100% sure that this is the person who is going to stay with me forever and this connection is solid uh, stable and mature and compatible all you want is a uh, like a uh, clear cut start in your energies clear cut start in your love life with all of the honesty and the truth of the universe until you are going to find that kind of energies you just want to keep your things to yourself keep your emotions to yourself you want to control each and everything in your life right now at this present moment virgo you can't do it right you can't stop yourself for in like for in falling in love with someone even if it is a wrong person you can't stop it but you are doing the right thing by taking it slow it's very very good actually very mature very good okay right now you just don't want to lose your freedom because you see the potential you want to fall in love with the person who actually is ready to be with you actually is ready to give you something solid and stable you don't want to go ahead with the potential only here very good very good virgo i'm so proud of you i'm see can you see the excitement on my face when i'm doing this for you guys let's see what's coming towards it till the 8th of october virgo Ace of Wands, a brand new beginning is going to happen in your life. A brand new beginning is happening. Your intuition is going to be very high, and you know intuitively, you know something is about to happen. Something very good is about to happen in your life. You know that intuitively. You know one chapter of your life is completely going to be closed, completely over. Let's clarify the Ace of Wands. we have the two of swords and the king of wands and the six of cups you are no longer going to be confused and stressed out about a past person or past situation or past connection 
that you thought you should do something about it when it's going to be over when i will become uh, coming out of the stressful kind of energy when i will be uh like taking the action to let go of this uh, situation from the past mm -hmm. i do see you're still stuck on the past in some way shape or form and you're wanting the answers from the past for some of you you want a reconciliation with a past person but till the 8th of october i do see you coming out of that energy of uh, like uh, come like wanting the past person past energy back in your life because you are going to be very sure your intuition is going to be very high that the past situation past connection is kind of over now there will be no longer any confusion yes of course it's not going to be like happening overnight one day you are going to wake up and you are going yay everything is fine and i no longer want my past back no it's not going to be like that slowly but surely you are going to release the past okay and you are going to start it from like first week of october only and you will be rewarding yourself with the new energies with new connections your intuition is telling you to let go of uh, the past and start uh, new energies start connecting with new energies new people especially the one who is trying to heal you and help you to grow very beautiful yes yes let's see the guidance for you guys you were very passionate about the past still might you are at this present moment but uh, by the first week of october these energies will start changing for you you will be releasing your past for good this time let's see the guidance for you guys virgo we have the sun card the king of pentacles and the king of swords okay you can't have the happily ever after stable mature grounded kind of energy if you are not ready to open up uh, your own energies first you have to be very like secure safe stable and grounded in your energies first of all with yourself once you are going to feel these kind of energies with yourself and then you are going to stay happy then these kind of energies are going to like come towards you naturally you don't have to like uh, be rude you don't have to be closed off you don't have to be in this energy of being bitter you don't have to be in this energy of i'm going to cut everything and everyone out of my life if if things are not going to go my way you you have to be a little bit adjust adjusting with new people new situations will go it's not going to happen overnight right but first of all you have to be happy content and stable within yourself okay your energies are going to attract these kind of energies towards you this is the catch <laughs> but anyway right now there is someone around you who is having a very healing nurturing and beautiful kind of intentions okay don't go look for this person if there's no one around you like this you, this kind of person this kind of energy is going to enter in your life very very soon or you are going to be a healer you are going to be a provider for somebody else for uh, someone else and you are going to fall in love with that person and then this connection has the potential to go uh, like a uh, long term okay so yep this is what i have for you virgos thank you so much for tuning in i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste